Hey, what's going on, y'all? Let me put this light on. I don't think it did difference, but um, as I was in the store, I felt like God was telling me some things of life is just not salvageable. You feel me? Think about it. When it comes to a lot of cars that we had in the past, we kept fixing it, we kept fixing it, we kept fixing it. Just kept breaking down, you feel me? And the breakdown, it gives more of a frustration. You feel me? It gets more of wear and tear mentally on you. And um, I want you to see this as that relationship that you, come on, you know, you know you should be letting go. But for some reason, you just can't. Um, let's just put some knowledge into it. Think about it like this. True enough, I understand. God can fix anything. But now, what I felt like God was telling me, not everything he wants to fix for you. Some things is just not worth it like when it comes towards that car. It's just going to be too much wear and tear on you mentally. And God has something more important for you. That he needs your mind to be focused on. Now remember. Throw it away. Think about it like that, like that car. If you take that car and you send it to the junkyard. You know what happens? Another man's trash becomes a diamond for someone else. When that car goes in the junkyard, another man said, oh my God, I've been looking for this car. They take things, they take things, and they ride with it, being thankful. You feel me? Now it's your part. You got to go ahead and throw that away, homie. Guess what? A lot of people who junk a car, you know what happens? Eventually, they get a new car. That was way better than the last one. They not even thinking about the old car. Because they so thankful for the new one. <laughs> so, remember. True enough, our God can fix anything. But he wants better for you. So go ahead, let it go. God bless. Amen.